I wasn't always very excited about math. I was more excited about reading novels and I thought I would become a writer one day. <laughs> I got excited about it maybe just as a challenge, but then I realized that it's really nice and that I enjoy it. He was born in 1977, the city of Ilan, a rich and rich city of cultural and cultural, De Heilan. Difficult times. It was during the war. Right after the war, I had a lot of opportunities. I went to a very good middle school and then high school. And I think I was the lucky generation because I was a teenager when things became more stable. 中学时代，米尔扎哈尼曾获得1994年及1995年两届国际奥林匹克数学竞赛的金牌。米尔扎哈尼1999年在德黑兰的谢里夫理工大学获得数学学士学位，随后他进入哈佛大学攻读博士学位。导师是1998菲尔兹奖得主、动力系统理论方面的大师。科蒂斯·麦克马伦，他在二零零四年完成学业，并获得博士学位。米尔扎哈尼专长几何学，研究领域包括泰西米勒理论、双曲几何、便利理论及新几何。My main interest is understanding structures you can put on a surface. There are different ways of looking at it. Either you have a surface with some additional geometric structures, or this kind of problems are related to understanding the space of such structures. One very famous example is if you have a billiard table and you start from a point and you hit the ball and it hits the boundaries and it moves, say, forever, you want to see the trajectory of the ball. Would it cover all your billiard table? Can you find closed billiard paths? And interestingly enough, this is an open question in general. If you don't put any restrictions on the angles of the polygon that you started, there are two types of questions. One is about you have a surface with a geometric structure, and you're trying to understand some properties of this geometric structure that you have. The other questions are related to you have a surface and you have a geometric structure, and you start deforming this geometric structure, and then you want to see what kind of surfaces you would get. Some of the problems, like you know the properties of a generic surface, a random surface. But it's really hard to say something about a single given geometric structure on the surface. Some of the work that I've done with different collaborators shows that sometimes the surfaces are very similar to the ones of a generic surface. You can ask these questions about hyperbolic surfaces, or these flat surfaces, or different geometric structures. Mir Jahani's wife is a Czech theoretical physics scientist who works at IBM Ahmedan Research Center. They have a son named Anahita. In 2017, on July 14, Mir Jahani died of cancer at the age of 40.